Jason Deagle's Star TTI again. Did you know that Rockford amplifiers have an input section called the balance differential inputs? Basically what it does is it helps eliminate engine noise in your system. But for more on this, let's go to the guy that actually designed and engineered this. Dave Baker, he's our electrical engineering manager here at Rockford. We're gonna take the camera over and just have a little conversation with him. Let's go. Balanced differential input to noise force field. Head units have a single ended output, basically one, you know, there's two conductors that ride on the RCA you have a ground and then the signal mm -hmm. conductor. Um, well, as they're running in parallel, they start to pick up noise, common noise, that, that's generated throughout the run. So the, the, the hot conductor and the ground conductor will pick up that noise. And typically, it, it's alternator noise. So with the differential input, what that does is it looks at the common noise between the two lines, the ground and the, and the signal, and it cancels it out. Once it hits that differential circuit, it zeroes it out so that common noise, no common mode noise doesn't make it to the to the amplifier core and ultimately to the speaker. So it doesn't you don't cancel out any audio. It only cancels out uh, uh, electrical noise that's common on both conductors. So the circuit recognizes what's common and subtracts that out of the equation so all that's left is audio. But the differential input will work with either balanced or single ended output and you get the you get the benefit of, of the common mode rejection. And typically we're seeing seventy D B worth of common mode rejection which is which is very good. A typical typical single ended input um, single ended amplifier input with no differential is typically about 45 to 50 dB worth of common mode rejection so we're 20 dB yeah it's superior to to that configuration alternators are not filtered at all you know if you were to take an oscilloscope and look at the the hot lead of an alternator you would see so much junk uh, that uh, you know gets on the audio you know, it gets on the routings and, and it needs to be dealt with. But it's something that's unique in, in, in car audio that, that you won't find in a home environment. You know, you may have some 60 cycle hum in a home environment, but you can easily filter out one frequency. Mm -hmm. Alternator noise is all over the place. You know, it peaks at, at, at a few frequencies, but then it spreads across almost the entire audio spectrum. So it's it's quite a, quite a challenge, you know, and a, a task to to, to get rid of that noise, but uh, the balanced differential input do a, do a great job at, at taking care of it.